May 5th, 2012. Happy Hanko de Mayo! Yay! Huzzah! I'm not actually gonna drink this because it's 6.45 in the morning, but you know, you get the idea. Okay, Hank, so this is the James Webb Space Telescope, which is being primarily built by the company Northrop Grumman and funded by NASA, the European Space Agency, the Canadian Space Agency. There are like 17 countries involved in it. And Hank, as you pointed out before, the JWST is gonna be really fracking awesome because it allows us to see objects in the distant universe, like out where the edge of the universe would be, but no edge. But the coolest thing is that by letting us see really far away, it lets us see really far into the past. Right, so here's a cool thing. Light travels about 186,000 miles per second. By the way, I'm getting to your birthday. The sun is about 93 million miles from Earth, which means it takes light about eight minutes to get from the sun to the Earth. And that means that when you look at the sun, not recommended, you're actually seeing the sun from eight minutes ago. That's like a moderately cool thing when you're talking about the sun, but it is an astonishingly cool thing when you're talking about objects that are like 13 billion light years away, because then you can see 13 billion years into the past. And that will allow the James Webb Space Telescope to see the formations of the earliest galaxies. It's a time machine, Hank. I don't want to oversimplify it, but it's basically an unmanned TARDIS. So Hank, in a video a few months ago, you said that the James Webb Space Telescope was like our pyramids. It was a monument that we were making not only for ourselves, but for everyone who would come after us. And you reminded me that while it's hugely important to decrease suck in this world, it is also important to increase awesome. So Hank, for your birthday, I wrote an email to my congressperson, Andre Carson, asking him to make sure that NASA gets the funding it needs to increase awesome. And Nerd Fighters, if you want to join me in saying happy birthday to Hank through this effort, there is information on how to do so in the doobly-doo. We also got you another present. This is the primary mirror backbone support structure of the JWST, which NASA and Northrop Grumman call by the memory initialism PMBSS. The PMBSS basically holds the whole thing together and it's largely made out of this crazy graphite compound tubing that is like crazy strong but also hilariously light. I know that it is hilariously light because Northrop Grumman sent me part of the James Webb Space Telescope for you to have. Well they didn't send you part of the telescope obviously, that has to go into space, but they had an extra part. Obviously Hank you won't fully understand this until it gets to your house, but this stuff really is amazing. Like I can't bend it despite my famous strength and also this weighs about as much as a paperclip. And yeah, Hank, this isn't like a common souvenir. There aren't a lot of these floating around, but this is your part of the James Webb Space Telescope. I, I hope you like it. Also, I have to thank Michael Gardner and everybody at NASA and Northrop Grumman who made this happen, especially Martin Frederick. So Hank, thank you for increasing awesome through Vaughn Brothers and the Lizzie Bennett Diaries and SciShow and Crash Course and Hank Games and VidCon and DFTBA Records and EcoGeek. You do too much. Hank, video responses are open and you'll find lots of birthday wishes from all over Nerdfighteria, including an astonishing number of regurgitated corn dogs. Hank, I hope you like this little symbol of our species' desire to increase awesome. Contact your politicians! It's easy and fun, or at the very least, easy. And they listen to you because they're scared of you. Happy Hanko de Mayo! You will see me again on Tuesday! Best wishes!